Today, Kevin and I are gonna be trying two very unique chocolates, and you will see why. Uh, they actually um, say Trump on them. Liz, my good friend in Ohio, she traveled to New York um, in early June, and uh, she stayed at the Trump Hotel, and while she was there, she thought of us. And I think that was that's just really special that she did that. She picked up two of these gold bars from the Trump Hotel because she knows that we love Celebrity Apprentice. And um, unfortunately, there's been a lot in the news lately about Donald Trump, and there will be no more Celebrity Apprentice, at least not for not him, with him, not with him. Um, so, uh, but I think this is awesome. I think it's a cool gift. I think it's a very unique. Um, and the company that made these is Debrand. And I looked them up, and I want to say they were in Illinois. I, I did look the company up, and I, I don't remember where. Um, I looked them up a few days Indiana. ago. Indiana. That was it. I knew it was with an I. Indiana. They are in uh, Debrand Fine Chocolates. They're in Indiana. It's www.debrand.com. -E uh, these are the same bars. They're both milk chocolate. Uh, one bar is 240 calories, and they're small. So, But I went to their website, and they have... Are you going to be careful? I, put it in. I don't know how careful I'm going to be. Um, they have all kinds of wonderful um, looking <coughs> truffles. Oh, my goodness. They have like a set of six truffles, and it's like $20 for six truffles. So I can't imagine how much this costs. These were not on their website, so I'm assuming they are sold at uh, the Trump store only, and you can't get them online. But they offer all kinds of chocolates. <laughs> It's a good and soft chocolate. It's not super, super, super hard. Does it look any different in the middle? No, mm -hmm. just a regular chocolate. It's good. It's a kind of a thick, waxy feel. It reminds me of some of the chocolate we have had from England. Yeah. It's good. It's very good, but it's not near as sweet as what you get here, <coughs> which surprises me that it's made in Indiana. Mm -hmm. Because, um, you know, when you compare a candy bar here, a Hershey's, to, um, to an English candy bar, like a... Um, I don't want to say arrow, but to one of their candy bars, you just don't, the, the sweetness, you just don't get that. This is not a sweet chocolate at all. Mm -mm. It's, it's like good. Hershey's. It's very good, but. Um, it's very rich. It has a really good chocolate flavor. Like mm -hmm. I said, it does have a, a little of a, a waxy, a waxy feel. Uh -huh. um, it's good though. It goes down smoothly. Yes. Smooth. Yes. I think. Um, Some of those chocolates I've eaten. American chocolates are really sweet. They almost burn going down a little bit because they're so sweet. They're this so is sweet. really good. This is, yeah, this is not like this. This is something that, that you want to eat slowly. Mm -hmm. it's like um, yes, and they're the uh, truffles that they had online, they have all different flavors of those. These are, are just the milk chocolate. So if you go to their website, you're going to see a lot more, and they have some great pictures, of, but they have sets, and they, they mail it to you, of course, so I just think that's really neat, but this is cool. Mm, that was good. good, yes, and thank you so much, Liz. We really, really appreciate it, and this is so unique, and I will, even though we've uh, cut off the end of this, I'm going to take a picture of it so that you can see it really good for the end of the video. So hopefully um, everyone else um, enjoyed this and thanks for watching.